Eats for Blackadder and Time Team star Tony Robinson was in Peterborough today to open a £3 million refurbishment of the city's museum. This report now from Russell Hookey. I now declare this wonderful museum reopened! For the man who's dug up countless fields in search of historic artefacts, today offered far less of a challenge. The reopening of Peterborough Museum by television presenter Tony Robinson means thousands of new items are accessible to people across the city. When I was a little boy, I used to come down from London and stay in Doddington uh, in the summer holidays. And we used to come to Peterborough and I would look up at this place and sometimes rather reluctantly go inside with my mum and dad. But it, it never felt, to be honest, that welcoming. Now it does, incredibly welcoming. A, a, a great experience for local people to get involved in. And whether it was Tony or a chance to try out the new museum, there was no shortage of visitors. Among the highlights, the recreated wartime hospital and a chance to see some unique images of Peterborough people then and now. Of course, one of the challenges for museums right across the UK is how you continue to attract new generations of visitors in a world full of electronic games and hundreds of television channels all competing for young people's attention. Well, Peterborough City Council think the changes which have been made here should address that. They are very used to touching computer screens and retrieving information, so when they come here they need to do that as well. But it's done in such a way that people of all ages uh, can interact on a digital level. And that is one of the other reasons this museum is so important. It's about its educational benefit to this city. The council is confident the museum is now among the best equipped in the country and expected to be a significant boost to the area's tourism industry. Russell Hookey, Anglia News, Peterborough. On to football now and on their last visit to Craven Cottage 7.